Okay, okay, it's time to do the home tour. So we're gonna start here on my porch. Let me turn you around and then we'll go over the tour. So the porch is pretty long. There's the garage, there's the front steps. And I've just got a couple of rockers out here. It's pretty bare right now. Can't wait to get here in July and get it decorated. So we'll come in to the dining room. Just got a little planter with a faux plant in it. And this piece I found on Facebook Marketplace. Got a family picture, some candles, some faux flowers. Oh, there's my broom. <laughs> it's cleaning up all the ladybugs. And these curtains are just shears. I didn't want anything too heavy and dark. We've got a gallery wall, which I'm still adding to. Okay, so we'll go back this way. We've got a coat closet here. And then upstairs, and I'm just not quite sure how to decorate this coat rack, but this is what I have for now. Bunch of, let me take this down. I've got a bunch of thrifted pieces. I love the thrift store. This little basket I purchased from Instagram. This little angel I found at Goodwill this little sign and there's another one in the bedroom um, came from Instagram as well that was in our last house picture of me and my mom at my grandma's funeral got a brass bell back here um, a little picture frame I have yet to put a picture in pictures, little willow tree, another little willow tree. This little phone is a like a music box. I don't know if I can. Anyways, found that at an antique store, thrifted, and then these books are thrifted. There's nothing down there. Little milking stool I found at the thrift store. is a eye chart calendar which I have set for the day we move here okay um, let's come this way so this is just a closet that holds all my cleaning supplies there's our bedroom this door is the bathroom it's just a little half bath All right, so there's nothing, nothing fancy about it. Just a bathroom. These little signs were thrifted. I found, let's see if I can get it to focus, found on Facebook Marketplace. And then that coat rack I found, um, I think at Goodwill, or maybe I thrifted it or bought it on Facebook. I don't know, but it's secondhand as well. So that is the half bath downstairs. Sorry, everything's just kind of blurry. 
Uh, this is our washer and dryer. The, well, the dryer is going right now and it's one of the things I want to do. I want to get done. But standard washer and dryer. I have ideas for this space once we move. We'll keep moving around to the left um, is the dining room, or not the dining room, the living room. So we've got a tall lamp there. Okay, so come back to my right. Um, this lamp was given to me. This little table I found at Goodwill and I painted it um, a green. The rocking chair was outside. <laughs> I brought it in because I felt like this corner needed something. Um, found it at an antique store. And this little um, basket with throw, throw blankets in it. Um, a little bucket. And up above the windows um, were these shelves that were already here when we moved in. So I just put some LED candles up there and our chief's gnome. Got wood and paper and this cool little guy, which my daughter accidentally broke. It's a bellows. He was an eagle, or he is an eagle. That was found in an antique store as well. Our ash bucket. Okay, this door leads out to a deck. And then here in the window, I've got a little sweet picture frame of a, a fawn and her mama. Fawn and doe, I found that at an antique store. Candlesticks, candles, and then my bookshelf that I want to repaint. Um, the candelabra came from a gal on Instagram. The plant is from Ikea. More candlesticks, family pictures, thrifted books, um, LED candles in a little brass thingy there. And then down here I've got my daughter's picture in a little frame, books, faux plant, bookend, and then a bunch of kids books down there. <laughs> okay, so we come back this way. I've got a hanging faux plant up there. I've got a little picture. A little farm picture. I don't know if it'll... Anyways, a little farm picture there. And then our kitchen. Um, here is our pantry. I'm not going to open that. I've got the dishwasher going, so please pardon that. Up here, I have... These are placemats that I found, like a set of six, and I just put two of them there. Got a little stove pic um, picture, keys. We've got my crock with my utensils that I use in it. cutting boards, a little cloche. We do use those cutting boards. This 
soap dispensers. Sorry if it's getting bright here. Um, some little thrifted pieces. And a faux plant. And then on this side, I just have more candlesticks and a handmade clock. And then on this corner, I just have a cookbook, a little oil lamp, and I think this is um, a wax warmer, but it just doesn't have like the wax warmer tr um, tray in it. Nothing over here. It's our refrigerator. Oh, and I did not go over this piece, so this piece I found on Facebook. One trip out here, I was messaging the lady as I'm on the plane <laughs> that I wanted this piece. It's gorgeous. My sister-in-law made that sign up there. So in here, I just have all thrifted pieces. So we have a mug. This is a little Bible box. Dough bowl with some hearts in it. And then there's nothing down in here. To put Oh, my girls is Disneyland wands and tiaras. <laughs> okay, so that is that. All right, so let's go into my bedroom. We'll finish off downstairs. And then we'll come, we'll go upstairs. Oh, my towel. <laughs> so I found this desk at an antique store along with the chair. It's kind of more like a kid's desk. So it's probably gonna go upstairs. Laundry I need to fold, pictures husband's tapestry and I'm this room is a work in progress so I haven't even done anything really with it the Bowflex machine was left here by the previous owner there's our bed with like five blankets on it because it's been cold I'm not going to show you our closet because it's a mess but here's our bathroom closet is over here shower uh, linen closet and toilet I mean I don't think we really need to see all of that but That is my bedroom. I would love to paint this bed, but that's a, that's definitely a chore for another day. Okay, so let's go upstairs. Turn the light on, I guess, huh? I love the detailing in this flooring. It's so beautiful. There's only two bedrooms and a bathroom up here. Uh, let's go this way. The shelf was left here by the previous owner and we just never took it down. 
but this room is very large. So, and then a little hallway. Got a bathroom in here. Full bath. My daughter's is bathroom. And then another bedroom. So that is it. <laughs> that is the tour of our house. I cannot wait to be here this summer. So that is our house. I have been here for two and a half days, three days, and I have just enjoyed every moment being here. Even though I'm by myself, um, I was supposed to have a family member that was supposed to come with me, but um, she ended up not. Oh, words cannot express how ready we are for the next chapter um, to be out here to get settled in this home. We have three months left, three months, and I know it's gonna go by quick because when I was last here in October, you know, July seemed so far away. Here we are, we've got three months to go. So, all right. Um, I, that is it today. Today I am leaving. So I've got to finish packing and just getting, getting the house in order to go back home. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I am so sorry that I've kind of been taking a break. Um, I just, like I said earlier, I'm just not really feeling motivated to film at the current house. I just feel blah. I mean, even though, um, we are very blessed to have that home. I'm just, I'm ready to be here. So hang with me a little bit longer. I do have some content coming up, um, decluttering. Um, we got a path to move. So I think I'm going to record that process as well. So, all right. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day, whatever, you know, time you're watching this. Um, yeah, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.